Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and my apartment. I'm Tiffany, if you've never seen me before, hi. Um, my camera lady is Sarah, she's my befriend. Hi. Um, and Toby is her co-camera man. Um, I actually had to wait for her. I was gonna do this video alone, but I needed somebody to babysit Toby, so. <laughs> she's here now. I gotta show you him. Look how cute him is. He's back. Um, anyway, I have a very, 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 very small Timu haul for you this month. Technically, I'm filming this in April. I'm going to post this in May, though, either the second or third week. And I don't have a, I don't, this is what it is. It's not big this month because I didn't have a big budget this month. Um, so I just kind of grabbed some other stuff that I've picked up from Timu over the last, like, two years or so, one or two years, I don't remember, over the past year, that's even sadder, um, some of it I bought myself, some of it Sarah gave me, um, but it's just little random bits and bobs that I've picked up that you guys haven't seen yet on this channel, just to kind of make it a little bit longer, um, so, First and foremost, I'm going to start with this because I didn't buy this. My mom bought this for me. Um, I'm not going to take it out of the actual, like, bag because I can't do anything with it yet and I will never be able to get it back in this sack because that's just how the laws of phys physics work. Never happens. This is a hammock. Slash, like, a hammock seat swing thing. She picked this up for me. I have always wanted a hammock, and every time I get one, it just it vanishes. It's gone. So I'm going to have my dad put this somewhere. I don't know where, and I don't know how, but I'm going to do it. So, and it just rolled off the table. <coughs> Sarah said I should put it in the bedroom. I'll use that one. Mm -hmm. yeah. Toby would like it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this stuff real quick, just because it's going to be a lot quicker than dealing with that yet. Um, so this is from Sarah. She actually just gave it to me last night, and I absolutely love it. It's so cute. So you guys have seen me haul pocket hugs before. This is like a fancier pocket hug. Um, it says, sending you a bear hug. I'm a little pocket bear. Squeeze me tight when you're feeling blue. I am here to give you strength and warmth that will help you get to get you through. Also, I want a disclaimer, I want to put a disclaimer that Toby now has a bell. So every time he runs around, you can hear him jingling, and I'm sorry for that, but I can't keep track of that cat. I mean, I can, but you know. Um, so this is a little pocket bear. This is so cute. It's just like, like one of um, those like traditional like teddy bears. And it is just so stinking adorable. Like, I want 50 of these. I want them in every single color, and yeah, I want one for Toby. Dollars. I want one in every single color, and I want one for Toby. I'm protecting this with my life. Because he would steal it, absolutely. But she just bonked his head on the table. Your aunt privileges are revoked. First your body slam him, and then... Oh, crap. Anyway, moving on. Okay, I have a bit of a, a bit of a beef to pick here. Um, I am very, I'm feeling very underappreciated in life. My mom orders from Timu, obviously. I order from Timu. Sarah orders from Timu. Timu can't even properly update my package most times. And my mom got, like, a gift box from Timu. Like, full of makeup. I don't really use makeup, but still, it's the, it's the fact of the matter. Yeah, well, give it time. Um, I kept these from the gift box because I really don't use a whole lot of makeup. These are tinted lip glosses. I looked them up on Timu, and the reviews said that they're pretty good. They last a long time. So, these are matte lip creams by pop feel I think um this one is in the color LA01 yep and this one is LA06 
So, yep. These Sarah also gave me last night. One is missing, but that's because it's in the sink because I used it to strain out corn. Um, these are big ladles. She thought they'd be like soup spoons, but they're ladles. Um, but they're very cute and they match my color scheme. So I'm not upset about them. In the same vein, I picked this up a year ago. I actually picked, no, I picked up just one. I thought I was picking up multiples, but I only picked up the one. This is a utensil kit. Now, don't judge the spoon. Um, the spoon is stained from all of the pasta. But it's a utensil set, and there's a spoon and a fork and a pair of chopsticks. And I got this for when we were going to go on vacation, and I never did. Um, but it's fine. It's fine. I still still use it on, in my everyday life. Next are these little refillable um, perfume bottles. There's a couple of different options of perfume bottles on Timu. Um, these are by far, like, some of the best because they have this little aspirator, I think that's what it's called, thing on the bottom where all you have to do is push it down on the little nub. You take off the, like, spray part on the perfume bottle. I don't know the technical terms. Sue me. And you just push this down on the little nub and it fills it up so you don't have to, like, Destroy your perfume bottles. I'm looking at you, Bath & Body Works, because you do not want anybody to get into those bottles. <sighs> these are great, though. So, I have I have a couple of these. I think I have, like, four. I'm not sure, but I this is the one that I had on hand. Also, these. These are amazing. Can I see your phone for a minute? Um, these are USB... Um, fans. It comes off in, it comes in two separate parts. So it comes with the blade and the little part that you plug into your phone. This is an absolute lifesaver, especially it's at like the Renaissance Fair. So this is the one, This they have different um, USB plug-in things as well, like for different sizes. These are the, this is the size that Sarah and I both use. So I'll show you real quick how it works. You just plug it in. And like, I don't know if you guys can see. <laughs> how it like actually, how strong it is. But it's like, it's like a really, really strong like fan. Um, and it does wear down your battery, but not as bad as you would think. <coughs> like you can definitely get a couple hours out of that. Um, so yeah. I will always swear by those. I think I got them for less than a dollar. So like, you know. Um, another thing is this medicine case. I actually got one for myself, one for Sarah, and one for a friend. However, that friend never got hers. So I gave it to my mom. But Sarah has hers. This is mine. Um, it is filled with medicine as well as something that Sarah gave me last night. is a little nail file. She also got this from Timu, obviously. And if you get one of these cases, they have all kinds of different styles. This is just the one that we have. As you can see, it's filled. Um, there's six small ones over here and two big ones over here. I highly recommend having something like this unless you have, like, really, really strong nails because these can be hard to get into. There's the listing. I think she got five of them for less than two bucks, so that's not bad. To be fair, this also went up since I bought them. I think they were like 95 cents. What happened? Chris. Oh. Um, but yeah. So this is really great because it just fits in there perfectly. Sarah had one for hers and I was so jealous. I was like, oh, I need one of those because like I am very much a person that uses their teeth to open things. And I know that's not good, but like, you know, when you have to do it, you have to do it. Um, this is also something that Sarah gave me recently, last night. It was just a little, it's an anklet, and it's a turtle. Super cute. Um, I picked, I have this. 
I think you guys saw the B version um, that Sarah got me for my housewarming, I believe, or my birthday, something like that. But this one I picked up for myself a couple of months prior to that. It's got dinos on it because I like dinos. And this is, like, super high quality. Like, this is a really good quality pouch. Like, there's a whole bunch of room inside. Um, and, like, it's so soft. The material is very nice. It's not like super um, stiff or anything. It's really, really nice. This is the other item that I picked up quite a while ago. Um, it's just like a small crossbody bag. Um, I use this for the Ren Fair or like the fair or somewhere I'm going where I don't really need my whole backpack. Just something small. Um, and I actually have ordered three of these. <clears throat> I have a light pink one I think I ordered a light pink one and a dark pink one I gave one of them to a friend and I kept the other one I think you have the light pink so yeah but it's just it's really nice quality it's like a faux leather you know um, it's got a pocket here on front which is usually where I keep like band-aids and stuff it's got a zipper pouch here which has some card slots and these, these pockets are pretty big. And then it has a secondary pocket, which is also very big. And inside it has a change pouch. Um, so, yeah. Uh, the actual size of the purse is basically like a standard like wristlet style. Which, if you wanted to, you could just use it as a wristlet. You just have to take off the strap, which is simple enough to do. It's just attached by claw clips. So, highly recommend that. I think they're like $5 or something, but, like, that's pretty good. Um, and the other two items that I have that I've purchased in the past that I'm going to show you um, are two of the smaller items. I believe I got gave one to Sarah. Because one of them, I got like a five pack of them, and I gave some away to people at church. Um, and the other one, I only got one for me. But this is the item that I got like five of and gave away. This is soap paper. That reminds of my suitcase. <laughs> so these little sheets of paper have soap infused. They're like really, really soft. Um, and all you do is you run it under water or, you know, if you're five minute crafts, you can use lake water, um, and it'll soap up and you can use it to wash your hands. Got that for vacation, of course. Never went on vacation. I keep saying sorry. <sighs> Doesn't change the fact that we never went. And this is another thing that I picked up. This is actually really useful for like every day because, you know, um, but this, these are little toothpicks, like little flossers and they came in this little case and there are, there was 10, I believe, in here. Some of them have been used. But, yeah, they're really nice. Um, so moving on to the new stuff, finally. I know, that's what y'all are here for, if you're here. Um, like I said, I really didn't have a big budget this month. I just got a couple of things that, you know, I desperately needed to get. Well, de de desperately need to get, but, you know, I really... Don't think I picked up much for the Ren Fair this time around. I do have stuff that I want to pick up for that. But mostly this is for me. I know. Shocker. I actually spent money on myself for once because that doesn't happen. However, the first thing that I'm going to pull out is something for Toby. Um, so this is for Toby. I got him this toy. It's so cute. It's a little octopus. It's got googly eyes. What do you think? Huh? What you got in your fur? What do you think about that? He has a couple of mice that I got from Timu that were technically pips, but then Pip donated to him. Oh, you can't get in the bag. Um, so I'm hoping that he's going to like this. It's really soft. Oh, yep, there he goes. Okay, cool. You sold? 
All right, you can take that and go. Was that the other color that they had for that? They had like three other colors, I think. They have a couple colors. Um, but yeah, that was for Toby. I think that's the only thing I got for him this time around. But next month, I intend on getting a couple of bigger ticket items for him, so we'll see. Um, I also got a bunch of phone cases. Well, not a bunch. I think I got like three. I don't really have any phone cases because I always have the weird phones that like there's no phone cases anywhere for them. And originally, when I first got my phone, I looked on Teemu for cases. They really didn't have any. But for some reason, I had the random um, urge to look again. And they actually got in so many nice ones, so many cute ones, that I wanted to go ahead and get a couple. I'm going to go ahead and take my current phone case off so I can show it to you, actually. Okay. Do you guys feel naked? You're naked now. Um, actually, it makes my phone so small. Uh, yeah, just hold it there. Okay. Right there. All right, there we go. Um, so this is the phone case that I currently have. Um, this is from Timu. This phone case actually does pretty well. I didn't think it would because it's just like a silicone case, but I, I am very much somebody that drops my phone a lot. And it's never really had an issue. Granted, I don't really drop it on the screen much, but, you know, it does fall quite a bit. Um, and this phone case is really he held up. This is a pop socket, obviously. Um, I don't think I have any currently in this bag, but I do have some that I want to pick up, but it's fine. So that's the one that I've been using, and this is one of the new ones. This one is so stinking cute, because if you know anything about me, I love flowers, and I love bears, because my nickname is Bearsy on Among Us, and just kind of in general now. But, like, look how adorable. It's a flower bear. I love this so much. This is probably the one that I'm going to be using for right now. Uh, I don't know, though. But it's so cute. I love it. <clears throat> and then I picked up this one. Let me get the paper out. Look how cute. Look how cute. It's got tiny dinies on it. I love dinosaurs and bears and just like bees, and, you know, color. So like this, I love it. And I think this is the last phone case that I got for right now. I think, um, like I said, I do have a couple more that I want to get, but I'm going to hold off on them for right now. So this phone case is fancy because it actually came with a wrist thing. I have no idea how this attaches, but I'll figure it out. It's actually pretty cute. It's like beaded and it's got flowers and butterflies and bows all over it. This is like me in a chain. And this is the phone case. Super duper cute. And this is actually making me realize that I have at least one pop socket in here because it kind of matches this um so let me see if i can find that real quick um, no i can't find it off the top of try oh there it is off the top of trying that makes a lot of sense right but here is the pop socket. Ooh. Same style as the other one. This is just kind of the style Timu has. That's very, very stiff because it's not been used. But I thought that that matched pretty dang well. So, and I like having pop sockets that match just because I'm senile like that. I'm gonna get a trash bag or anything. I guess I can use one of these for a trash bag. I can use this for a trash bag. 
it both. Yeah, that works. Okay, <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> moving on. It's y'all, y'all know it's coming up, and it's your favorite part of the team of halls the stickers. So, I got this pack of stickers. Look how pretty these are. These are just like all different kinds of butterflies. And you know, I like my butterflies and my stickers. They're so pretty. I also got this pack of stickers. I got so many stickers this time, and I'm, I'm happy about it. I love stickers. However, probably within the next haul or two, I'm going to have to actually get another sticker book. And that time, I will probably also order Sarah's because she wants one as well. Um, because I keep hooking her up with stickers. I wouldn't be a good friend if I didn't. So this pack, I think, is just like all like blue. I got a lot of colored themed stickers this time around just because I really liked the idea of having them after that pink pack I got. But this sticker pack is kind of nice because it has like different sizes of stickers. It has some like sh some small stickers, which are always nice to just kind of fill in the gaps. Um, yeah, give me one second. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. I had to blow my nose. I also had Sarah go ahead and grab my um, sticker book. You know what? I'm going to stick these behind there because... There we go. <laughs> that is so makeshift, but whatever. Um, Toby update is absolutely in love with that octopus, so that's good. I'm glad. Um... Moving on, oh my god, I just saw something in here that <sighs> has a story. <clears throat> so, moving on to this sticker pack. Um, I have no idea what the sticker theme is, but the very first thing I see is a tie-dye scrunchie, and I'm here for it. Um, this is just, like, all kinds of, like... I don't know. Throwbacky, cute, kawaii, colorful things. Look at this tie dye turtle. Love it. Um, <laughs> that's what Sarah thinks every time I order more stickers. But, you know, oh well. She also likes to think that. Oof. But, whatever. Um, okay, now the thing that needs a story. Yeah, you heard that laugh, didn't you? <coughs> so, Timu has these, like, Legos. They're not Legos, obviously, but they're, like, micro blocks, I believe, is, like, the um, name brand, you know? Um, but they're, like, the tiny Legos, which I do love. Yeah. He needs them all, obviously. She was showing me more of the octopus toys. There's, like, 20 of them. Um, I have a couple of these in my cart that I want to get. They weren't supposed to be ordered yet. This was not supposed to be ordered yet, but I gave Sarah my phone to look at my cart. And she accidentally pressed this and removed other things. So... So now I have a duck. This is a duck. This is like a rubber ducky. I'm not upset about it because I did want it at some point. It just, it just threw off my groove a little bit. Because this, this doesn't match the vibes. This does not match any vibe. I'm not upset about it. Also, it looks like it has a lot of pieces, which I'm here for because I love Legos. This is my newest one, by the way. I did it last night. It's a little blender. Not a blender. A mixer. Super cute. Um, moving on. This is actually a necessity because I got a new desk recently. Sarah got it for me, so thank you. Um, 
but the edges on it are very, very sharp. <laughs> like, very, very sharp. So, I ordered some of these corner caps to put on the desk because I keep poking myself in the arms. It's not fun. Also, now that I have Toby, he likes to hang out with me at the computer and walk all over the computer, so I don't want him getting jabbed either. So, um, I have four more things in the bag. This is another item that wasn't meant to be purchased yet. This was supposed to be a Christmas purchase. But, um, once again, I gave Sarah my phone, and she accidentally selected this instead of, you know, just looking at stuff. Um, but that's fine. It needed to be purchased eventually. I just need to put it somewhere so that I don't lose it until Christmas. Um, oof. It's all tangled up. Give me one second to figure it out real quick. Oh, it's definitely dead now. <laughs> all right, so I'm back. Um... I got it untangled. As you can see, it's a necklace. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. He only stopped because he needed water. Mm. Um, yeah, so this wasn't meant to be ordered yet. This is going to be a Christmas gift. Um, every year at church, we do this thing called Secret Sister for Christmas. It used to be a thing that was all year long, but, like, the economy sucks. So now we do just do it for Christmas, and it's like a Secret Santa thing. Um, so, spoiler alert to anybody who might be watching this who might get me for Secret Santa. Um, this is a gift for Secret Santa. It's a necklace. It's actually quite big. Um, very pretty, though. It's got, like, a little diamondy cross and a heart gem. And it says, I am a child of God, which is, like, a really big thing in our church. Like, it should be a really big thing to, like, anybody or anywhere. But, like, it's especially big at our church. And we just kind of did a theme. Sarah actually did a um, ladies meeting message thing. And we had them all basically announce that they're a child of God because it went along with the vibes. And, you know, yeah. So, that's for whoever um, I get as a secret Santa or secret sister. Um, I have a couple other things that I want to get to go along with it, obviously. But that's just one of the items. I'll probably give it to Sarah to hold on to because things just kind of go missing in my house. Or maybe I'll put it in the box with the um, Renaissance Fair stuff for right now because, you know. Better than not. The last three things I have are more stickers, obviously. Oh, yep, three items. So, this is another one of the sticker packs, obviously. <laughs> Toki is so cute. He's running around with that octopus like it's his kill. <clears throat> so, this is like a green pack. <clears throat> I'll show you a couple of them. Sorry. Bless you. Thank you. At least it wasn't one of the loud ones. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, okay. And the last two items are some of these small little sticker boxes. So. Yep, I'm done with that. So, I got... I love these boxes, by the way. They're so cute. Um... I got Sarah one of these boxes before of, like, sunflower stickers. These ones are all, like, vintage steampunky kind of looking ones. I think Sarah will like a lot of these because she really likes that kind of vintage style. There's also, like, vintage nautical, you know, that kind of thing. And the last thing that I got, the last stickers I got, ugh. the one thing about these boxes is they're kind of hard to get out sometimes, so it's whatever. Um, they're all cats in honor of Toby. They're just cats. So many cats. I imagine Sarah will take a bunch of these ones, which is fine. 
The best thing about these, though, these little boxes, is they usually come with duplicates. So, um, yeah. So usually these ones are nice because I can keep one of every single one if I want. Technically, Sarah could too. <coughs> so, that is my team haul. Um, I did manage to get it to 30 minutes by hauling everything else, which is great. Um, yeah, so that is that. I'm going to go and go through the stickers and everything and then let Sarah do the same. And I will go from there. Bye.